Welcome back with a new math tutorial. In this video, we are talking about solving one step inequality. As we solve for the equation, in solving the equation, we'll use the inverse operation. Also, for solving the inequality, we'll use the inverse operation. So, in question number one, we need to solve each inequality, then graph the solution. We have x plus 7 more than or equals to 10. As we solve for the equation, we'll use the inverse operation. Because we have plus 7, so I will use minus 7. Now x will be more than or equals 10 minus 7 will be equal to 3. Now we need to graph x more than or equal to 3. Just we write 3. Because more than or equal, it will be closed circle. Once we have more than, it means we'll shade the part which lies at the right. If you remember in the previous lesson, we'll just say that more than and less than will be open circle. And more than will just shade the part which lies at the right. Less than will shade the part which lies at the left. Now we have here more than or equal and less than or equal. More than or equal will be closed circle. And in more than we just shade the part which lies at the right. Less than we just shade the part which lies at the left. The same in question number 2. n plus 2 less than or equals 5. Because we have plus 2 we just subtract 2. So n now will be less than or equal 5 minus 2 will be equal to 3. Just we write 3. Because we have less than or equal, it will be closed circle and we just shade the part which lies at the left. In question number 3, we have 2 plus y less than or equal 3. Because we have here 2 as a plus or positive number, just we shift it by subtract. We will use the inverse operation. So y less than or equal 3 minus 2 would be equals to 1. Just we write 1. Less than or equal, it means it will be closed. And because it's less than, so we'll shade the part which lies at the left. a plus 4 less than 9. Because it's a plus 4, I will subtract 4. So a now less than 9 minus 4, which equals to 5. Just we write 5. It's less than only, so it will be open circle. Because it's less than, so we'll shade the part which lies at the left. In question number 7, we have h minus 6 more than or equal to 13. Because it's minus 6, I will solve it by adding 6. So now h is more than or equal 13 plus 6, which equals to 19. Just we write 19. Because it's more than or equal, so it will be closed circle. And we just shade the part which lies at the right, because it's more than. y minus 3 more than 9. Because it's minus, I will use the inverse operation, which is addition. So y now will be more than 9 plus 3, which equals to 12. Just we have 12. More than it means open circle. And we just shade the part which lies at the right. In question number 11, we have 5x less than or equal 45. 5x, it means 5 multiplied by x. As usual, we use the inverse operation. The inverse of multiplication is division. So we just say divided by 5. So now x less than or equal. 45 divided by 5 will be equals 9. Just we write 9. Because it's less than or equal, so it will be closed circle. And it will shade the left part. 10x less than 8. 10x, it means 10 multiplied by x. So we'll use the inverse operation, which is division. I will divide by 10. So x now, less than. 80 divided by 10, which equals to 8. Just write 8. Less than, it will be open circle. And we shade the part which lies at the left. 5y more than 30. 5y, it means 5 times y. Just we divide it by 5. So y now, more than. 30 divided by 5 would be equal to 6. And because it's more than, so it would be open circle and we just shade the part which lies at the right. 7x more than 56. Just we divide it by 7. So x now would be more than. 56 divided by 7, which equals 8. Now we have 8. More than it will be open circle and we just shade the part which lies at the right. In question 17, we have x over 6 more than or equal to 7. Over 6, it's mean divided by 6. We will use the inverse operation, which is multiplication. So I will multiply it by 6. Because you multiply by a positive number, no change for the sign of the inequality. So x now would be more than or equal 7 multiplied by 6, which equals to 42. Now it would be 42. More than or equal, it would be closed circle, and we just shade the part which lies at the right. 
d over 3 less than or equal to because it's a divide i will use multiplication because we use the inverse operation so d less than or equal 2 multiplied by 3 which equal to 6 now we write 6 less than or equal it means be closed and we just shade the part which lies at the left and that's how can we solve the one step inequality